Hi, welcome to Adventure RV Group here in Napa. I'm Sheena and today I want to show you the new bunkhouse in town. This is from Dutchman. It's a 2023 Aspen Trail LE 21 BHWE. It's a mouthful, but it's short, it's sweet, and it's got everything. It has the electric front tongue jack with manual crank override just in case. You get the two larger propane tanks. When you buy it from us, we fill them up for you and give you a deep cycle interstate marine battery. Over here, we have your solar prep. So not only does Aspen Trail already throw a solar panel on the roof for you, it also has an additional solar prep for portable solar panels. So you don't have to pay to have the labor done to install more solar if you need a little bit more help on the road. I love it. This is a pass-through storage. The baggage door is a magnetic latch. It's nice and large, so you can fit small children, your dogs, <laughs> your husband. Uh, right inside here, you have the controller for the solar that's already on the roof, and then it has a new inverter prep, so less you know, unknown holes being drilled into your trailer is the idea an easy upgrade. They also have given you a light inside here and it's just a great thing to have the pass through so you can access stuff on the other side as well. This little controller here is showing us that we have electric stabilizer jacks. You have two in the front, two in the rear. It just makes setup just a little bit easier. Push button. Who doesn't like that? You have a speaker hiding right here and a speaker hiding over there. That is going to give you surround, surround sound feel underneath your awning. It is electric. It has the LED lights. And you also have a little bit of a 110 plug here. This is cool for all sorts of things. I've even started prepping my white table out here with my crock pot sitting out here if we have plugins and that makes for a really easy dinner. People also do like ceramic heaters, radios, whatever you can imagine, it's here for you. Notice the ground clearance on the Aspen Trail. It's higher up, some would call it rugged. You can go to those places that are a little bit more unexpected of terrain and know that you're not gonna drag off something <laughs> because your trailer is sitting too low. And then back here, you have your spot for a I think they call it a C-channel connection for a table or a grill that would hang on here. Your outdoor propane quick connect. And then of course, a mini fridge. On the back side here, you've got your backup camera. I love it. You download the Lippert app. You use your cell phone as the screen. So when you're backing up, it's gonna make sure that you don't back up too far. You're not running things over and you're not gonna damage the back of your trailer. And down here, you have the new Furion tankless hot water heater. I love it. It means that you can take as long and luxurious of a hot shower as your water supply can supply. <laughs> uh, it's gonna make for a really nice long shower if you're hooked up to city water and does a nice job as long as you don't use all your fresh water tank water in just one shower. You may want to, so be careful. <laughs> uh, on the back side, you do have a sewer tank flush. It is something that has to do with dumping your black water. After you dump the black water and the gray water, you're going to plug into the sewer tank flush and you're going to clean off all the sidewalls of your black water tank. It will keep your black tank healthy and happy going down and the lifespan of your trailer. We've made it to the inside. This feels large in here. It is a small compact trailer and it's amazing how nice and roomy it is. Up here, right when you enter, we give you the motion sensor control panel. I love it because it's going to sense when you're in front of it, needing to know what your fresh water is, what your black water is, gray water, and battery power. The other feature that they have up here is a Bluetooth connect so that you can, with the, the app that you download, communicate with your trailer and see some of those things like tank size or what lights you have on and off. It's pretty clever, getting pretty smart. Over here, we also have the new tankless hot water heater control panel. That's gonna be where you turn it on and off. And as you can see, it's hitting a 124, which is pretty hot. <laughs> it would make for a really toasty shower. The front has the residential size queen bed. This makes for a very comfortable area to sleep. They've also done some really tall 
shelves up here for your, your hanging dresser area and then a nice bar so that you can hang some jackets and clothes and things like that. The, the queen lifts up for some really valuable storage. In fact, this is where they've stored the outside griddle for you. You have lights, so if you do like to stay up late reading, you have an easy access light to turn on and off, and it makes for some well-lit trailer in general. Both sides of the queen bed will have plug-ins for you just in case you have that CPAP machine or need to plug in your cell phone. The kitchen. I love the kitchen. Cooking camping is one of the most therapeutic things that I enjoy doing while camping. And this one, they've given you the glass cover with a three range stove. You have the LED lights to make it look cool. And then also the light inside the oven so that you can see if your lasagna is boiling over. <laughs> we have a light up here and a fan. The exhaust fan will keep things from stinking up the trailer and also contain the heat and it'll suck the heat out too when you're cooking. They give you an extra light underneath the kitchen cabinets. I love that for lighting. And then they've got magnetic real wood cabinets. Beautiful, deep, lots of storage. Storage is always key. Look at how hard I actually have to pull on those. So the idea is you're not gonna have your stuff out on the floor just because you've gone on a jiggly travel or a jiggly trip. Microwave and your DC refrigerator. It's a huge refrigerator, lots of space. In fact, just from having the battery hooked up, we're already getting cold in here. It cools down very quickly. And then one thing I want to point out back in this back corner too, I don't know if my pictures on the, on the website are showing it good enough. You have a really great drawer down here and down here and lots of cubby space. For this tiny of a trailer, they're really maximizing the storage. I also want to mention that underneath this whole dinette seat and the front half, so they had to designate a little bit of it for something else, but you've got storage in this guy. Right up here and up here. I love it. I can already see my paper towels and paper plates and vodka bottles. No, <laughs> just one. <laughs> also, I, I wanna point out to you that it does have a furnace on board. Here's your thermostat and then your air conditioner. These pump out really nicely. It's gonna keep you really cold on those hot summer days or really warm on those cold winter nights. We've made our way to the bathroom. I'm standing in the large bathtub. This is great for washing small children, the dog, your feet, and some of you could even enjoy a bath in here. You've got a nice tall shower head and the vent up here gives that extra tall person a little bit more head space so they can reach over their head to wash their hair off. This also opens up so you do get to suck out any of the steam because of course we wanna keep the water contained. <laughs> You've got the toilet, the sink, and counter space. I love the counter space in here. Again, more storage so you can shove the toiletries where they belong. And then they've also done a medicine cabinet in here with a cute little mirror. Well lit, I like it, great bathroom. We found the bunk beds. You guys, one of the reasons why we started this channel on YouTube is so that we could show you guys in the middle of COVID that couldn't get here physically to see the size and how everything felt inside. So this bunk has so much space. Look at all this room in here. This is adequate for an adult to sleep in. You can put two teenagers, you could put toddlers, and even if you put a cage up, you could put your baby. <laughs> this has an emergency exit window right here that has a blind that keeps privacy and light out. Each of the bunks has a light that's pretty easy access. I have to say in all the bunk houses that I've carried, I've had bunk beds with the lights way back in the back, where as the adult, it's hard to climb up there and turn that light off. Some would say impossible. These think about you having to turn off these lights in case your kids leave them on. So I like that feature. This makes it fun for the kids. You guys, this floor plan is really cool, really compact, and it should fit all your camping needs. Come by and see me, I'll show you it. The Aspen Trail LE 21BHWE is a total length of 25 feet and 11 inches. The unloaded vehicle weight is 4,600 4, pounds. 
and it has a fresh water tank capacity of 52 gallons, a gray water tank capacity of 38 gallons, and a black water capacity of 38 gallons. This is a great floor plan for compact and functional family fun. Give us a call today and don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Happy camping.